Hey, what's up? This is my new old bike, the All City Super Professional. This bike is a large. It's the black fleck. It's got a kind of like a rainbow fleck to it. Kind of looks like a fishing boat or a fishing lure. Currently, I have the All City Large set up as a single speed with their uh, proprietary dropouts. And I'm rocking the All City Fork, but currently waiting on a wound up that I ordered last December, so hopefully it'll show up soon. This bike is through axle, 142 millimeter spaced. And on the back, I have the stock All City hubs, like I said, set up single speed. These are WTB rims, STs with Horizon 47C tires. For brakes, I got tall clamper flat mounts. I got a black one in the back. And I got a silver one for the front. I'm gonna take that sticker out there. These are cable pull disc brakes and they work and feel really good. With those poles, I also have pole levers that I got from Tall Ass Mike. Shout out to Tall Ass Mike. Bought these off of him a while back. Finally putting in the use. And they're mounted up on these. These are Simworks by Nitto. These are the Stealth Bars. And these are 700, I believe these ones are actually 740 millimeters. They're pretty nice. They have a really cool sweep to them, as you can see. And those are mounted to uh, the bike with a Thompson 110 millimeter stem. And the faceplate underneath is a custom anodized camo with some gold tie bolts. Of course, I got the quad lock on the front and we got the chat right here. This bike has internal routing, or I should say routing for a dropper post. So for the dropper post remote, it's a wolf tooth, my favorite. This is the light touch. And that's going down the down tube and then around the seat tube there, up the seat tube, into this Fox transfer seat post. So when I push this button here, this when you're sitting on the saddle, it, it goes down. The seat goes down. If I push the button here, the seat goes up. For the drivetrain, I got these Dura-Ace 2x cranks, looking to replace these at one time. This is a 44 tooth in the front, a 16 tooth in the back, and yes, we are rocking an XX1 Eagle Peacock color chain that goes nicely with the fleck on the frame. This was left over from Amir's mountain bike, so I got to use it. Lucky me. For the saddlebag, this is uh, Outer Shell from San Francisco. And the front bag is, against all odds, it's uh, Life Behind Bars. These guys are out of Jakarta. When I went out to Jakarta, I got this off them years ago. And I think it looks nice on the bike. So if you have any, oh, not done yet. This is a Physique Argo saddle. And, this cool top cap I got in Russia by uh, Sweet Ghetto, Oh Sweet Ghetto. And one up, platform pedals. These are the metal ones. Anyways, that's the bike. Hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you have any questions or if you have a super professional yourself. Catch you guys in the next one.